Healing Meditation Words for Beginners of Meditation Chapter 1. 1. The mental natures asterisk are the result of what we have thought, are chieftained by our thoughts, are made up of our thoughts. If a man speaks or acts with an evil thought, sorrow follows him, as a consequence, even as the wheel follows the foot of the drawer. 2. The mental natures are the result of what we have thought, are chieftained by our thoughts, are made up of our thoughts. If a man speaks or acts with a pure thought, happiness follows him, in consequence, like a shadow that never leaves him. 3. He abused me, he struck me, he overcame me, he robbed me. In those who harbor such thoughts hatred will never cease. 4. He abused me, he struck me, he overcame me, he robbed me. In those who do not harbor such thoughts hatred will cease. 5. Not at any time are enmities appeased here through enmity but they are appeased through non-enmity. This is the eternal law. 6. Some, who are not learned, do not know that we must all come to an end here asterisk. But those who know this, their dissensions cease at once by their knowledge. 7. As the wind throws down a tree of little strength so indeed does Mara, the tempter, overthrow him who lives looking for pleasures, uncontrolled in his senses, a moderate in eating, indolent, and of low vitality. 8. As he wind does not throw down a rocky mountain, so Mara indeed does not overthrow him who lives unmindful of pleasures, well controlled in his senses, moderate in eating, full of faith in the Buddha, the low, and the saw, gha or community, and of high vitality. 9. They who imagine truth in untruth and see untruth in truth, never arrive at truth but follow vain imaginings, desires. 10. But they who know truth as truth and untruth as untruth arrive at truth and follow right desires. 11. As rain breaks through an ill-thatched house, so passion makes its way into an unreflecting mind. 12. As rain does not break through a well-thatched house, so passion does not make its way into a reflecting mind. 13. The evil doer grieves in this world, he grieves in the next, he grieves in both. He grieves, he is afflicted, seeing the evil of his own actions. 14. The righteous man rejoices in this world, he rejoices in the next, he rejoices in both. He rejoices and becomes delighted seeing the purity of his own actions. 15. The evil doer suffers in this world, he suffers in the next, he suffers in both. He suffers thinking, evil has been done by me. He suffers even more when he has gone to the evil place. 16. The righteous man rejoices in this world, he rejoices in the next, he rejoices in both. He rejoices, thinking, good has been done by me. He rejoices still more when he has gone to the good place. 17. Even if he recites a large number of scriptural texts but, being slothful, does not act accordingly, he is like a cowherd counting the cows of others, he has no share in religious life. 18. Even if he recites only a small number, if he is one who acts rightly in accordance with the law, he, having forsaken passion, hatred, and folly, being possessed of true knowledge and serenity of mind, being free from worldly desires both in this world and the next, has a share in the religious life.